What a song! And we are here with Judah. Hi, Judah. Hi, everybody. How are you? <laughs> we missed you since the last time we interviewed you. And here we are here again. Interviewing you now with your song Stay that will compete in the San Marines final. Right? Yep, yep, it's Stay. The new version is out and I couldn't be happier with the new version. I think it's powerful. I think it's, um, there is a journey in the song. I think the production and the arrangement. Uh, I worked with uh, Stefan Mosel and he did Brilliant job, brilliant job. It was a pleasure working with them one-on-one, brainstorming it together, and I think the result is it's amazing. So I'm happy. I hear that you're satisfied, and uh, it's really great to hear. Um, uh, but I want to ask you about uh, the other song you sang in uh, the competition, Moonlight. Actually, it was my favorite from all the songs of all the artists, and I think he decided. <laughs> I'll be fair, and I will say, in my opinion, it was the winner in this selection. Can you tell us why eventually Stay was chosen for you? Um, first of all, I, I know you, you like the Moonlight more, but me personally, I like Stay More uh, because uh, of uh, the meaning of the song and the lyrics, uh, I connected to it more. Um, and because I thought it's going to be interesting if three of us will sing Stone and Stay. <laughs> but if uh, three of us will <laughs> sing the same... Uh, The same song. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I just, I mean, you have to remember that when you get the song, you get it in a completely different uh, production. It's, it, it get, you, you hear it in a, like as a verse and a chorus. You don't really get to hear the entire thing. So you really have to use your imagination. And, the, and Stay was more completed as a song. Uh, in the Moonlight, it was really like a last minute putting together a song, I mean, it came out very, very well because, you know, you, like you said, it was your favorite, but to me as an artist, as a singer, it was kind of, I didn't feel it complete yet. Um, so yeah, I mean, in a perfect world, I would have produced both to the best of um, my ability as, as, a, as a songwriter, producer, and then you would could really tell which one is the best, but that stay is my song and I, I couldn't be uh, happier, honestly. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think on stage is gonna get even uh, another layer of uh, power um, because I love singing live. <laughs> yeah, I know that you're even a better performer when uh, it comes to the live versions. And yeah. you said before that stay Um, the lyrics of Stay are, you are more connected to them than Moonlight. Uh, can you tell us about the song, about Stay? What does it talk about? So Stay um, is a song about um, uh, separation, about a breakup, if you want to put it this way. It's about someone who's about to die and you're basically, I'm begging that person to stay for at least one more day, as it says in the song. Um, uh, yeah, the, the way I see it in my head when I sing it and the way I envisioning it uh, is in, in Hebrew and in, in the Jewish religion, uh, um, we believe that when you're about to die, you have this almost like a hallway, like a, a tunnel that There is the transformation from the world of the, the living and the world of the, the, uh, the dead. So I see myself standing with that person right there in the spot where, where there is a transition. And I'm just trying to pull him, him or her back to the world of the living and not let go. 
of that person. Because there is a line in the song, which is uh, the new verse that I wrote, that wasn't there in the er, in the mm-hmm. acoustic version, and it says, "The angels call out your name; they crave the light in your eyes." Mm-hmm. Meaning, the angels want you as much as I want, but I need you to stay here. So that was your. Uh, it was your choice to add this line to the song. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think it gives it... It doesn't exist in the other two versions, and I'm happy. It's mm-hmm. so good. It's something think yours it's inside the song. Something, something me... Uh, of course, I try to stay loyal to kind of uh, the lyrics that we kind of dropped out and to use some of the... Uh, like the word, the word angels, for example. It was in the old version, so I kind of borrowed that from that and kind of obviously had to change it to fit the melody uh, but I think I think it was a really smart idea and the results is there and mm-hmm. I think it's a really really good uh, addition to the song as you said before another two artists Franklin from Malta and Sebastian Schmidt uh, from Germany will sing in the final uh, stay as well Um, what do you think about the, this competition, this inside com- inside the competition, another competition between three singers that sing, all of you sing the same song, a bit different, yes, you had your adjustments and still the, the lyrics are the same, almost, and the music almost the same. Um, what do you think about that? Um, well, I can judge only on what I heard. And I hope, I hope that nobody will change his version now hearing other people's versions because, you know, let's keep it fair. Because mm-hmm. uh, so all can... the other artists singing different songs. If it's oh, Jessica yeah. or Camila or even uh, Tinish, uh, yeah. right? Yeah, but Say is the only one that is repeating two times. Two Do you times. think... It, it maybe gives us a clue that this song will be chosen. Three singers sing the same song. Like It's, it's definitely, in my opinion, uh, the best song in the competition. In my opinion. But oh, obviously I'm not completely objective because I sing that song. Uh, but, you know, we could all choose the other song as well because we had that option to choose any of the other songs. I could choose... Uh, Jessica's songs and I could choose uh, anybody's songs but I decided to go with Stay because I really believe in the song and I really think that this is the best Maybe Yo No Soy Tu Chica were a better song for you What do you think? <laughs> I leave it uh, for Camila <laughs> <laughs> uh, I love her by the way She's one of my favorites over there yeah, She's very nice uh, Yeah But I think my version of Stay is, you know, is the best. <laughs> I remember um, our last interview, you said you're going to yeah. see another version of Judah, the more balladic Judah, and I think you promised and you fulfill uh, yeah. your promise because uh, it's a ballad. It's a true yeah. ballad and it's very touching, in my opinion. I think it's very strong ballad and when when I hear this song as we heard at the beginning it reminds me some songs uh, like uh, Harel Scott's uh, Milim if you remember from 2010 it's something great that explodes at the end and it has really impressive moments um, do you think Um, your ballad stay will have the same impact as Milim or other songs that were a bit the same? Uh, well, obviously, it's two completely different uh, songs. Uh, I know Tomer Adadi, who composed Milim, who composed my song in 2013, personally. So it's a completely two different animals. It's from the same jungle, I would say, but completely different animals um, but yeah definitely uh, the explosion at the end it's 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 a must in, in a, I think in this kind of um, style of songs 
and I and that's the reason why I edit and that's why we arranged the song and uh, the vocal arrangements that you know I came up with um, are there um, mm -hmm. for that reason to make it more Eurovision you know stage ready um, you know because when people listen to the song I want them to really envision how it's gonna look on stage because I feel when somebody is actually doing this that means the song is good that means the song is ready to go you know to Eurovision so yeah yeah and Judah tell me do you know about the support that the production gonna give you or any other contestant who will represent San Marino um, you know everything that has to do with dancers or the show or the uh, pyro well likely for me <laughs> my song is a ballad yeah. so you don't really need much in terms of dancers <laughs> Luckily, uh, I like those songs I sang in 2013, which, you know, at some place, I guess that's also what made me choose uh, something that is more simple in terms of staging. I really don't know uh, how much of, uh, in terms of the stage, the production will provide, to be honest, because we didn't get any information about it. Uh, I know that we get some dancers for people who wants to use them, but um, but again, we don't have much time to rehearse because we're getting there the day before. Mm -hmm. I so, see. I mean, if you live in Europe, <laughs> in the the country, the neighbor country right next to Bratislava, then you can bring your dancers with you. That's a huge a huge advantage, and you can bring your props with you. But as for me, I come all the way from across the ocean because I, I, I'm uh, based in New York, so for me it's going to be a little more complicated. Uh, but I promise you that you won't be disappointed. Because just like I promised to... Yeah, exactly. To You're good at, uh, at promising <laughs> and then... Uh... Yeah, well, because my name is on the line and, and, and just like I promised to bring a good production for the song and that it's not over yet, and here we go, I brought a really good new version for Stay, I think 10 times better than the instrumental acoustic version. Uh, you'll see. We have a lot to wait and we will see. It's gonna be next week, the final of San Marino. Who can vote for you or any other contestant? Only San Marino's yeah. people or? No. Oh. No, 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 the voting actually has already started. So the way it works, it's a little complicated, so bear with me. Basically, um, everybody's songs are in this website that's called um, Global Rockstar. And in this website, every person, fan or any person who wants to invest money in the song, by investing money, you're basically buying share of the song, and by buying shares, you, you can earn um, royalties from the song. So every time the song is being downloaded or being played on YouTube or Spotify or, you know, TV, iTunes, you basically, based on the amount of money you invested, yeah, you get money back, okay? Now, the money you invested is basically your vote. So the basically the, the singer who is gonna get the most amount of money wins the 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 fans vote. Mm -hmm. I see. So it's not necessarily the amount of people who vote; it's the amount of money investments. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So I hope your song is gonna be a great investment, and <laughs> it surely yeah. sounds like one. And it is a great so, so Judah <laughs> I see maybe that's the idea behind the selection you know I asked you before about the the support of the production maybe the money they will raise they will give to the winner to yeah. supply the dancers and so on yeah most likely but it's I mean 
there's nothing wrong with that because you know yeah it's a good idea you know like if you heard what happened in greece they they was they were supposed to have the national selection and in the end they chose uh, the singer they choose the singer with the song uh, because her label company was the only company that uh, agreed to pay everything in all or almost everything and all the other labels said like what we we don't have the money to to put so much money in the contest yeah 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 no yeah it's not a cheap business <laughs> But, um, I mean, regardless, listen, I really believe in my song and my version of Stay. Um, I think it's going to be a good investment. And um, I think it has a really, really good chance to make it big in the Eurovision. I'm not even talking about next week competition. I, I, I see it bigger. I see it in Eurovision taking San Marino, San Marino to a uh, really good good place we start with the final taking them to the final and then from there the skies and uh, the skies are the limit so yeah and Judah uh, if we're talking about the uh, odds you are currently the fan favorite to win this selection what do you think about it how do you feel about it <laughs> well that's new to me <laughs> <laughs> that I'm a fan favorite but I do appreciate it Listen, every time I get a message and, and every time I get a comment that is supportive <clears throat> and every time I even have an interview with Eurovision bloggers and websites and, you know, Instagram and so on and so on, it means so much because, you know, there is a saying that says all it takes is one more supporter to support you to make it big. So every little support means the world to me and you know I really really try to um, communicate and comment and write back to every message that I get via Instagram my Facebook page um, my pers- personal Facebook page and my website so please thanks uh, thank you so much for all the support this is a good opportunity to thank all of you for everything um, you're done so Judah basically takes the lemons and makes a lemonade <laughs> out of them, as you, you can see. Instagram post. <laughs> exactly, I'm promoting your Instagram page. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. <laughs> yeah, I did post something on Instagram. <laughs> that, uh, yeah, well, well, I put my twist on it, obviously. But if life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Exactly. You know? Smile exactly. and do everything with smile, good energy, and I'm sure that transfer and and you you know good energies to the universe and anything can happen. Exactly. So we hope you will have all those great energies in the final show. It's gonna be live, yes. and uh, we're gonna okay. vote and invest our money in this lemonade supplier named Judah Gagra. Yes. Maybe my song should have called be called Lemonade. Exactly. <laughs> I think maybe Beyonce or her managers will sue you, but still <laughs> worth the try. Oh, by the way, what do you think about the beer? Should I keep it? Yes, it's sexy. I think you should. It, should it should stay. 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 Leave the beer. Yeah, we'll exactly. See. So, Judah, another yeah. another question for you. Let's talk business. Who do you think, except a few, can take this national selection and win? Now that we all hear, heard the songs and we know the production and we know the final results. Among the other singers? Yeah, except a few. Uh, who, who I think. Yeah, question. yeah. Uh, I think Emma has a good song. I love Camila. So you think it's gonna be between Emma or Camila? Yes. Well, it's not going to, but that's what I think. That's your opinion, yeah. I see. And um, 
Another thing, um, I think you heard that the, this year the competition won't have uh, the LED screens. It's going to be uh, the lights as it was in Norway, as, <laughs> as I feared. And I think it's going to be great for, song like, for songs like Stay uh, because those songs yeah. are depending on good vocals. And that's something I think we all heard you have. Um, do you think it's going to help you if you're going to be chosen? Definitely. Listen, a good song is a good song, but I don't know how much you can bring with you. Like, I don't know if a song, let's, for example, like Heroes, if he would participate in this year, if exactly. he could have brought with him this, because I know the Sweden brought it with them. So I don't know how it works. But yeah, definitely, uh, that has an impact, definitely. Uh, and I, I think a ballad will do much better with this kind of staging. Um, but a good song is a good song, so yeah, but definitely Stay will stand out in a stage like this. Mm -hmm. So Judah, if you can sing us mm -hmm. some part from your song Stay, to sing, yes. Yeah. Yeah, I can. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. <laughs> Stay with me. I need a miracle. Don't leave me this way. Won't you stay for one more day to hear the sound in the trees. Wow, very nice. Let the sunlight dry my tears. Invest your money right, invest your money in Judah Gavra with the song Stay next thank week. Thank <laughs> you, thank you, Michael. Thank you so Crossing much. Crossing fingers for you, Judah. Hope you'll do well and win the competition. And thank we you. all will watch, right? Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye.